Welcome plungers. Thanks for pulling up. And thanks for tapping in. Well, I did it. I completed the water pen. So we're gonna go check it out real quick. If that's all right with you, I got some flippers. And I got a scuba tank. And I got uh, a mask that I can make, but I don't think it's all that necessary. I turned off the fog, so uh, I'm a little way down. What the heck do I got on me? That weighs so much. It's these cryo balls. How much does this? weigh five pounds the scuba tank is 20 pounds so let's just make our way over there real quick this is what i wanted to do in the original episode of the reveal of this place i wanted the the doors to swing open and oh my goodness all right i'm just gonna i'm gonna speed this up all right here we are So first of all, all right, let's check it out from the top. I built kind of a catwalk, but I, I didn't make these. I probably could have made these metal steps, but I guess a ramp is cool, a glass ramp. Because on the other side, it's, you know, glass ramp. So I want to stick with that. Then you got your generator here to power the trough, the automated arc trough that's inside the pen. And I got a catwalk going all the way around and every other side on this side, I have an exit leading out into the water and every side over here i have an entrance into the pool i'm gonna jump in over here because this is the only only one i put a ladder up i didn't think it was necessary to put a ladder at every entrance but i might just do that after all and i got my dunkleostis in here I move much better in the water. So the Thames can't get out. But nothing can get in either, so... I think I'm pretty good. And that's what it is, man. I'm gonna... I'm gonna jump out and get the Griffin real quick. Oh, I was moving slow because, uh... I was wearing the flippers. That's why I was moving slow. And there's gonna be quite a bit of glitching because this this place is it's, it's massive. There's a lot, there's a lot of assets on here, and it might get worse when I throw this this guy out or this girl out, Jill. All right, let's take a look at it. So, see, there it is. It's the quick update on this place. Now it's gonna be time to start getting into some taming. Get down to the real meat and potatoes of what's going on. Oh, well, let me show you this part right here. Since since I got the scuba gear on, I'll show you, you know, that. So it's all, it's all in, in clothes, so I don't gotta worry about any dinos getting in here. Unless there's like a lead sickest, lead, lead sithis, lead sickest, sithis, sithis, or something that could get over here. Maybe break through, but 
for the most part, I'm not really worried about it. And in there is the food trough. And yep. I don't know what the heck he's doing up there. Where did he go? I don't know what he was on just now. Maybe, maybe he's on aggressive. Maybe something was attacking me. I don't know what she was on. I gotta get get into my head that it's a girl because Griffin. I don't know. Adrian Griffin. You know, I have a big dude when I think Griffin. But this is a girl. Her name is Jill. And maybe in the next episode, I'll tell you guys why I named her Jill. But that's all I got for you guys right now. So uh, thanks for tapping in. Thanks for pulling up. Peace.